In a penalty shootout, the probability that Henry scores a goal is 0 0.3. Find how many penalties must be taken so that the probability of scoring at least one goal is greater than 0 0.9. So what we've got here is a binomial distribution question, and we're actually being asked to find the number of trials. Let x be the random variable of the number of goals scored in n trials that will be. So x will be binomial n that we don't know, we're going to have to find out, 0 0.3. And the probability that x is equal to x is ncx, 0 0.3 to the x, 0 0.7 to the n. 0 0.3 because the probability of scoring a goal is 0 0.3. Therefore, the probability of not scoring a goal will be 0 0.7. We require the probability of at least one goal, probability that x is greater than or equal to 1. That means at least 1 is greater than 0 0.9. Now this is, can be found by doing 1 minus the probability that x is equal to 0 is greater than 0 0.9. So applying this formula here for this, we're going to get 1 minus nc 0, 0 0.3 to 0, 0 0.3 to the n minus 0 is greater than 0 0.9. However, nc 0 is 1 and a, anything to the power of 0 is 1. So these both here are 1, so we just end up with 1 minus 0 0.7 to the n is greater than 0 0.9. If we take this over here and this over here, we're going to get that 0 0.9 is greater than 0 0.7 to the n. Solving using logarithms, and we can take logarithms to any base, we'll do taking logs to the base 10 on both sides. So there's my inequality. If I take logs to the base 10, we don't write the 10 in for log to the base 10. So log to the 0 0.1 is greater than log to the 0 0.7 to the n. Now as a rule of logarithms, it says log to the base a of x to the n is equal to n log a of x. So now applying that to the right-hand side here, we get log to the base 10 of 0 0.1 is greater than n log 0. Uh, log to the base 10 of 0 0.7. Now, we're going to divide by log to the base 10 of 0 0.7, but we've got to remember that log to the base 10 of 0 0.7 is negative. Therefore, we're going to get log to the base 0 0.1 divided by log to the zero, log to the base 10 of 0 0.7. This is negative, so in inequalities, when you divide by a negative number, it reverses the inequality sign. So we're going to have that n must be greater than log 0 0.1 divided by log of 0 0.7. On our calculator, we can actually now write these values in exactly as they are using the log button, log to the base 10 button. You could have done it with ln as well, or you could have done it with any other base for that matter. When you work this out, you're going to get that n has to be greater than 6.455, but you can't have a number of trials being a continuous number we need it to be a discrete number so we take the next big number available to us which is seven therefore seven penalties have to be taken you should always try to refer it back to the context of the question okay so this has been a video and showing you how to find n for of a binomial distribution for a particular given probability i hope you've understood and i thank you very much for watching